Yo, what's up guys, today I'm gonna show you how to make auto-resizable text you on Android. Let's create a new project. Resize text view. Yes, and the first thing you need to check is uh, that you're using uh, version 26 of support library. That's basically all the setup that you need. Let's just delete some of the layouts. Fix some stuff here. All right. And I think I'm just gonna stick with the preview for displaying stuff. It works just fine. All right. So what is uh, auto resizable text view does is it changes text view size depending on how much space uh, is available for it and first question you need to ask yourself is uh, is displaying all the strings all the words in the string essential for you if uh, yes then auto resizable text you is not an option for you because it does not guarantee you displaying all the words the reason behind that that uh, is because uh, your text you should have fixed uh, dimensions like you know you can't use wrap content it won't work i think the the best use case for it is for displaying titles let's just uh, try to create one All right. And here's the attribute that you need to use and set it to uniform. It's gonna resize this uh, text size. So by default, there is a few attributes that set here, like set a minimum text size is uh, 12 SP, maximum is uh, 112 and there is also clarity i think it's called yes it's set to 1 sp which is uh, how much your text size increments each it's uh, each step and that's basically it you just have your size text type set to uniform and uh, it's gonna resize text size automatically but let's just try to set wrap content. As you see, it doesn't work. So you have to hard code one of the arg attributes for dimensions. Oops, not this one. Which can cause you to miss out some words like this. Let's add a few more. right yeah so basically it will shrink but if you have a single null line title like with setting max lines to one and uh, having me minimum text size to like 30 something right in this case you would uh, miss out some words and the other problem is that for example if you have a text you underneath auto resizable one then let's see what you can get that's just regular text you 
the text one more fix all right here it is as you see this view takes a uh, 100 dps and uh, there is a blank space here which goes by that so you can get some awkward layouts because of that but if you delete some maximum lines restrictions uh, then it's more or less okay and one more thing that let's bring the max lines to one which uh, I think it's a nice stuff to use with the with the auto resizable text you can add for example if words don't fit there is a nice attribute called ellipsize and uh, let's try it now yes this attribute makes it nicer with the dots at the end you can also have it in the beginning like display just the last part or middle that's weird and it's more natural this is kind of useful and yeah basically I like it uh, using uh, as titles either like this on top or at the bottom of the screen and there prefer preferably there shouldn't be any text use around this resizable text view because you cannot uh, tell for sure how much uh, spare uh, space there is gonna be and the thing that with this is that you can actually change text view it seems easy because it's easy to set up but really it's uh, very complicated because lots of uh, criteria goes in line here like uh, text view dimensions number of lines minimum and maximum text sizes all this stuff is uh, and basically you don't know what you're gonna get because uh, it's not as, as easy to predict uh, as with the fixed text size because for example if you have uh, undetermined strings then it makes it even harder to predict but uh, limiting to number of strings makes it easier then you at least kind of know what it's gonna look as you see here with the super long text text size shrink down so much then you need to set minimum text size for at least 18 sp yeah and basically that's it uh, it's uh, super easy finally we've got our android support library auto size text view implementation and we don't need to copy it from stack overflow anymore feel free to try it out and uh, click like take care